Hello my friends and welcome to another Tuesday of Tutorial. I am Leonardo Perez Nieto and today I will take on the challenge that Danny Hernandez sent me, consisting of drawing with the left hand, <laughs> which is something I have never done. Let's give it a shot. I will attempt to draw a French bulldog. I begin by marking where the head will go, the top and the bottom, with some sketchy lines. This is a very rough sketch of the head, with the sides like so, and this other side. This is the body he will be laying down on the floor, and the legs. I'm trying to do this with loose movements as much as possible. Even though my left hand is so tight, it's painful to watch. All right, and I'll make some guidelines to place the features, a horizontal line and a vertical line, both across the middle. So far, since I did rough lines, trying to use the whole arm wasn't so much a problem, but now to do the detail, it is almost impossible to do it with the left hand. For example, this is supposed to be a smooth, rounded shape for the eye. <laughs> This dog is looking more like a turtle, so far. <laughs> Here the nose, like so. And the mouth. He looks like a sad turtle. <laughs> Some wrinkles on the forehead, so characteristic of this breed. And then the ears. Drawing the ears makes it look much more like a dog. Okay, very good. Yeah, I think it begins looking like a dog. And I draw this eye slowly and very carefully, trying to make the round shapes look round. I am speeding it up a lot for you, because I'm truly drawing painfully slow. My hand is not being very obedient, doing what my mind tells it. <laughs> it is actually doing it, but very slowly. I have to be patient. I think in drawing, half of the job is seeing what needs to be done, so that's with your eyes and mind, and the other half is actually doing it. And that's up to your hand and arm. Since I'm not able to make accurate lines and shapes with my left hand, I'm doing the shadowing mainly by scribbling, by doodling shapes. And in this way, little by little, I can achieve a decent result, I hope. The ears are folded down. This drawing may not be the most accurate I have done, but interestingly enough, I think it has character. Every artist and every hand has its own personality and I am finding that maybe my left hand is a little bit more expressive than my right one, which is more accurate. <laughs> what do you think? And finally, after a lot of work, these eyes are looking somehow like eyes. They are not done yet, but they are at least looking like eyes. And we continue with the shading. Let's draw the chubby paws of this little dog with the nails and more doodling and scribbling for the shading. This is pretty fun. After a rough start, I'm now actually enjoying drawing with the left hand. What helps is that this breed of dog has a lot of character by its own. So they are very nice to draw. They are so expressive. All right, we give it the last touches, the last details, and it's ready. Please, in the comments, let me know your opinion of whether this challenge was met successfully. And if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like, share it to your friends, and subscribe to Fine Art Tips. And I will see you on Tuesday.